Broadcasting from the TV production studio at Ken Island High School on Friday, December 20th. This is your Buck Report. Let's get started. First up, let's talk about today's events and meetings. It looks like Navi started his winter vacation a little early. He's here to remind you to take some time for yourself over break and practice self-care. Whether that's spending time with family, curling up with a good book, or going somewhere warm to soak up the sun like him. Make sure you take some time to rest and recharge. We'll see you in the new year. PBIS here with our public Win the Day winner. This is a bi-weekly segment that will recognize a student who has won the day by doing something positive for others. All Win the Day winners receive a certificate with their positive referral recognition along with a small gift card. Forms can be found outside the media center or inside the guidance office. For those students recognized on the announcements, they will also receive a Win the Day shirt featuring the colors of the Maryland flag. Today we are recognizing Teresa for going out of her way to contact the teacher when the substitute plans were incomplete. Explain the confusion and ask for clarification on the given assignment. Nice job. And now for a look ahead. For those interested in trying out for baseball in the spring, there will be an open gym this Sunday from 10 a.m. to noon. Contact Coach Schulte if you have any questions. That's all the time we have today. We leave you with our final Getting to Know Can Island video of the year featuring Mrs. Paluski. Have, have a great, great holiday, Bucks! Bucks. Yako Paluski. Presently, I am a school counselor here at Ken Island High School. Yes, I have. I was an educator for quite a while. I taught um, biology mostly in both the middle school and the high school and at the college level. I've always loved science. Um, I always liked the puzzles of science and biology just really excited me. I studied microbiology in college and uh, exercise physiology. I got my undergraduate, undergraduate in exercise and human performance at the University of Toledo and I got my master's degree at Cleveland State University. Given the right environment and the right relationship with the teachers and staff, every student can meet their potential and, and excel in academics. Um, kind of two things. One is really around that academic advisement and talking to students about their courses, how are you doing, and what their plans are after college, whether you want to be a carpenter, a nurse, a doctor, a pilot, is really helping students find that path. And the other is just kind of dealing with life and how to, um, that roller coaster of your emotions and everything that's going on is still focused on school, so it's helping with that also. Italy. Uh, Sorrento is me the most beautiful place on the planet and someday I won't want to live there and be tired.